Carroll Girls at Shuttle Hurdle Relay down here at the State Track Meet. We're going to start off with Ashton Perrin, who started things off today. Ashton, how'd you feel like you got out of the blocks today? I got pretty well. I didn't want to. I was a little nervous about false starting because it's state and I was freaking out, but I got fine. When did you feel like you settled in? Because I know when we talked to you, you kind of seemed like you were a little nervous and then kind of watched even before the race. You looked like you felt still kind of nervous. Once I got over like the first hurdle, I was like in the swing of old things and I was able to three step most of them. So. That was good, and I felt comfortable again. Really looked like you kind of picked up some speed as as kind of things went along. Yeah, um, usually I can only get three stuff like the first couple, but there was nice weather, there was any wind, so I could three stuff at least four or five. Where did you feel like you were at your most comfortable today? Um, the first half was the best. Uh, I twisted out of like the fifth one and kind of slowed down there, but. It was pretty good at the beginning. Able to keep your balance on that one. Did you feel like you were able to kind of clear those last couple of ones comfortably? Yeah, I caught my knee on the very last one, but I recovered and got over the line. Uh, talk about the experience just being down here. It's crazy. There's so many people. It's not like any other meet, but there's just like a couple hundred. There's literally people everywhere, and the stands were all filled, and it's there's so much excitement. It's awesome. What are you going to take away from today? Um... It's nothing to be too nervous about. It's an awesome experience, and I'd love to come back next year. Well, hopefully you'll be back next year. We thank, thank you. you very much for joining us thank here. You. Let's talk now with Bianca Earlback and be the second leg today. Uh, your first time down here running uh, in the shuttle. First time uh, running, yeah, up. in the shuttle. Uh, talk about what that was like today. Um, it was a great experience. It was just a learning experience. It was our first time for basically all of us. Mm -hmm as a shuttle hurdle so we just had to get used to the idea that this is a regular track meet get that into our heads now i know you've been here before so what did you take from those experiences to kind of keep your nerves settled today um what i took i just decided that it's just a regular track meet i shouldn't be nervous as long as i do the best i can then i'll be happy with that and if i don't i've just got to walk away happy bianca how'd you feel like you ran today take us through your portion of the race um well, for the first half, I started feeling good, and then I started slowing down, and I started striding for my three-step, and I just decided that I should probably switch, and then that's when I got out of whack and kind of screwed us up. So. Did you feel like you adjusted there right towards the end? Or? Yeah, I adjusted probably wrong steps, just wrong. You know. Talk about what it's like, though, uh, running with these girls down here, first time together down at State. First time together, we're all so excited. We're all like freshmen, sophomores, except for our senior, Katie. We're all kind of young. We're all just getting ready and getting ready for our seasons and being excited about everything, being down here for state. So it's just a great experience. Well, Bianca, I appreciate you joining us today. Best of luck. Congratulations on a great year. Thank you. Let's move over now to Maddie Stenbo. Maddie, uh, what was this like for you? Talk about the experience. It was very humbling because you notice that there's a lot of other talented teams out here and you just never knew it because we just did meets in our little area of Iowa. <laughs> How did you feel like your run today? Kind of take us through your portion of the race. Um, I knew I had to like start out pretty quickly and finish really good. And I was trying to catch up to the girls in front of me. And that was just basically what I was trying to do the whole time, just trying to catch up. So do you, were you watching those girls, or were, do you have to focus in on the hurdles, or is that just kind of a, a feel and a, and a step thing that you have? Mm -hmm. um, I really don't notice. I don't really think about how I hurdle or, like, my technique when I'm hurdling. I kind of just watch the other girls, and I know I have to catch up. So I just kind of run as fast as I can. Did you feel like you ran a pretty clean race today? Yeah, I didn't have anything today. What's this experience like? You know, talk about maybe the senior here, Katie, and what it was like to run with her. Um, she's a very good leader, and she kind of like led us around because she's been here so many times. So she knew what she was doing, and we were just all kind of following. What did you? What, what's maybe the biggest thing you took from from talking and watching Katie down here? Um, just keep working hard and try to compete with everyone and stay calm. Well, Maddie, appreciate you joining us. Hope to see you back down here next year. Congratulations. Thanks. Talking with Maddie, let's move over now to Katie Trecker, that lone senior. And Katie, congratulations. Uh, you're kind of the you know the, the old horse here. You, you know exactly what it's like to, to be yeah. down here with all the experience. What did you tell some of these younger girls their first time ever doing this? Oh, just relax. Just breathe in your nose, out your mouth. Just relax, really. That's were, all you need to do. Were you able to keep relaxed today, you think? Um, yeah, well, we had so much time to kill since being here at what? Leaving at like 11. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah. how did you kill the day? Um, I felt pretty good, but on like the last three, I was trying to catch up to the girl. And I think I just like 
um, overdid it. So then um, I had to transition to four. Then I tried to get back to three, which I shouldn't have probably done, but worth a try. It looked like you were flying before that little bit of a struggle yeah. there. Were you feeling real comfortable up to then? Yeah, I just wanted to get that girl in front of me so bad. Like, I wanted to get us in second, but... Things don't happen the way we want. Well, you still got some more races coming up. What yep. are you going to do to prepare for those? Uh, sleep. Uh, <laughs> relax, stay out of the sun. Keep hydrated. Yeah. Well, Katie, I look forward to talking to you after those events. Appreciate you joining us here today.